Appar 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 apparition. Apparition, apparition. Apparition. Ah, hey guys, this is Tyler coming at you from SportRx with my buddy Andrew. And we are talking today about the apparition. It is a part of, uh, it is a new, a new edition, a part of Oakley's new collection that they call the Iris Collection. Yes, the Iris Collection is all about following that Oakley tradition of being a little bit more disruptive by design. So any of the Iris models will have this little Iris eyelet there to complement the frames. It's pretty unique and we're pretty excited about it. Uh, and before we get into it, definitely check down below uh, all of our info in the description and like and subscribe for more information like this uh, because we have a lot of other Oakley goodness out there. And anyway, so the Apparition. We have two versions of this, as you can see. We have the RX version, or the, the ophthalmic version, and then we have the Sun version. The RX version comes in two eye sizes. We have a 53 and 55 eye size. So I'd call that a 53 is going to be more of the medium, the 55 is going to be more of the large. Switch it up. And we'll throw these on. I have the 53s, he's got the 55s. And the, is a very cool design, definitely that more oversized aesthetic, which I think is still very in. And it feels really comfortable, it's a good frame. Yeah, yeah, super, super comfortable. Um, just has a traditional saddle bridge, but sits really nice on my nose. Yeah, it is a, a particularly comfortable saddle bridge. I'm not sure what it is about it, but it, it does feel good. Uh, for sure. So like we said, 53 and 55, the sunglass version is 55. So it is larger and that's typical for a sunglass frame is you want more lens and uh, generally they are going to be a larger eye size. All of the features outside of the sizing are the same. You have grip on the temple. You have a, a mixed material. What do they call this? Frame front material? There's a lot going on with this frame. So you have a, a nano matter frame front, which is Probably we are describing it as maybe being a little bit more rigid than O matter. Yeah, it definitely feels a little more substantial than O matter. If you're really familiar with O matter and you grab these, you'll notice that it's a different material. And uh, I think that the rigidity lends itself well to the structure of the frame and how the the temple attaches with that eyelet, that iris eyelet. Uh, I definitely think there's a reason for it, and it, it also makes the frame feel more substantial. And it's a good, it's a good looking frame, and it feels good. Oh, it feels great! You know, I got the spring hinges here. Uh, also, stainless steel temples uh, with a little unobtainium uh, sleeve on them there. So again, adds to the overall comfort, but also helps to keep them in place. Good grip. This is a very, a very tech full, tech, tech, techy, technical, technical frame. Yeah, and we're pretty excited about it. So hopefully this is uh, helpful information. If so, give us a thumbs up. And if you would like more information, Andrew, where can they find more information? On our blog. We have a blog about this specific frame as well as a ton of other Oakley eyeglasses and sunglasses. So good. Thanks for watching, guys. Mm -hmm.